flame sword. He's it's, still here. Yeah. Yeah, he's, he's still hanging around Rifle Tower trying to hang out uh, and get these kills right now. Five two big. players picks up the double kill right there. That's going to be two. Triple See if he can turn three on there and yeah, he has a triple. He gets it. What a play out of flame sword as he is going to tip the odds in their favor. So when did you start playing competitive Halo? Started playing competitive Halo back when I was in high school, my junior year. Got Halo One and Halo Two at the same time. Beat the campaigns, jumped on, started just playing to the matchmaking. Heard about something called MLG. Was like, what is MLG? Someone told me it was Major League Gaming. People play Halo for money, and I was like, all right, sign me up. This is what I would love to do. And then really started going out to tournaments in 2008 when I was 18. And mom and dad couldn't boss me around anymore. Being like, you're, you're you're 17, you can't travel on your own. I'm 18 now. I'm gonna go where I want. So true, it true, all true. started in 2008. So this is a bit of a secret, hidden fact. But I went. My first event was 2007 Meadowlands. I went for Halo 2. I placed fourth round in the free for all, and third round in 44s. So I believe fourth round was like 100 something, and then third round was like we were a top 128 team. So it wasn't good. So you start from bad positions like I did, and then you rise up to the top. What impressions of Halo 5 do you have so far? I only have a few. I played Warzone at E3. I got to try that out. The player speed for your Spartans is the fastest out of all Halos, which is really cool. The other thing is um, all the weapons all have a really good use for them. Like the pistol's not. Every weapon you could use to outgun an opponent, and depending on what situation you're in. The cool thing is we're going to Gamescom next weekend. Uh, we're actually going to be able to uh, try out the first arena stuff that they have for us to try out. So I'll be able to kind of get more detail once I do get to play that. But I'm really looking forward to that um, and trying to compare it with some things from MCC that hopefully we avoid. And then we do get the perfect Halo that we want working once launch does come around. That you guys deserve, honestly. Yeah. But being in front of Red Bull, do you get noticed more often? Or are you, you know, is your fame kind of risen in the past, you know, since you've signed with them or what? Fame's definitely uh, risen a bit. I've been with Red Bull since 2011. Immediately once I signed up with them, I, I got to see all the benefits that came with it, which is very cool. And then ever since joining Optic Gaming was another like fame little boost of impact and uh, get noticed a lot more. And now with the 80 million Red Bull cans, it's just kind of even, plat not even plateaued, but even just risen to a higher point now where if I go into a store, people get like, wait a minute, is that you on the can? So it's uh, been pretty cool. Thanks for watching Little Bros, please click that subscribe button if you're new here for more reviews, interviews, discussions, and more. Also check out the official Twitter for Flamesword himself down in the description below. I'll see you guys in the next one, and as always, game on.